I'm Shawnee Darden. I'm an esthetician in Los Angeles and the founder of Shawnee Darden Skincare. I was giving facials out of a rental house. Then I created the product, Retinol Reform. It was really stressful. I had my two kids. In the beginning, I started with like 10 facials. By the end, I was probably doing like 40 a week. Today, I have my studio in Beverly Hills. My line is in all the Sephora stores in North America. And I'm going to show you why I made this. Growing up, I lived in a small town. As a black girl, where everyone was white, it was definitely a very hard time for me. For anyone, having skin conditions when you're young is so difficult. I remember I had hypopigmentation from a rash I had had for a while. It was really difficult. And I look back at pictures now with makeup that didn't match my skin color. So I know firsthand what it feels like to struggle with how you look. My mom finally took me to a dermatologist and that's the beginning of my journey and love for retinol. From smoothing fine lines, decreasing pigmentation, helping with acne, it's truly an amazing ingredient. But I couldn't find one that was gentle enough but still powerful enough to change someone's skin. So I went to a chemist and worked with them on what I wanted to see, what I wanted it to do. I launched my first product, Retinol Reform, about 10 years ago. I'm taking my best friend DJ to my back house where I started my brand and where I used to give facials. I haven't been here in like five years. It's obviously changed a lot. This is where we were every day. All the magic. So this is where I started Retinol Reform and this is where I would test all the products. I'd give them to clients right there in the kitchen. And the crazy part is that it started that I lived inside and that was my studio and then we moved all the way into the house. I just, it seems like a dream, but I'm just so proud. I'm getting emotional Same. just thinking about I it. I know. I am obsessed with all things design. I wanted to design something that was me. I don't know how many bottles it's actually changed into, but I was very specific on the bottle that I wanted. This was first. I definitely put this sticker on myself. I was putting the labels on the bottles and putting it in the box, and I was shipping the products out from my bedroom. It's been a challenge also because I wanted a specific color, which is not apparently like a real color. It's a whole thing. And then we went into this gray bottle, my favorite bottle. And the square, because yeah. not a lot of people do square. Yeah. And then when we went into Sephora, we yeah. kept the bottle, mm -hmm. but we changed the deco so yeah. you could read the name of the product on the shelf. And yeah. it looks so good. It has a nice weight to it. Yeah, it's it gorgeous. It feels chic. It just, it was a long journey, but it's still my favorite bottle. Dr. B, one of my biggest mentors, is about to show up. I can't believe she's gonna get to see my studio. I haven't seen her in years, and I'm so excited. Dr. Benitez, um, which was the dermatologist I worked for, taught me everything about working hard, how to treat people, having compassion. Oh my God. And the majority of people that I worked on were kids from, you know, 11 and up, so it was a full circle moment for me. You were an empty glass, you were ready to receive everything, everything, and look at what it did. I, I mean, just being myself for you, it just helped you be what you were going to be anyway. You were just so caring, so, and I think I got that from you. I love you. Thank you, Don, thank you so much. You're welcome. I'm so proud of you, my God. So proud of you. you my brand launched at Sephora literally the week after the pandemic started. I started online first, Sephora.com. The product really started to take off. After that, they really kind of guided me through everything. It was like a dream come true that they would even take me. When I first saw my product at Sephora, I was beyond excited. It's still surreal. It's been a pretty great journey with them.
I do believe that when you're going in the right direction, when you find your path and what you're supposed to do, it's just right. There's just something about skin, I just really enjoy it. It was what I was supposed to do. It was always my goal to try to give people their confidence back. That's my beauty journey. My products are for everyone, all skin tones, all ages. It's just about making people feel beautiful, and that's why I made this.